Is there a permanent chemical change that takes place in your brain after an assault like that? It depends on the survivor. The good news is there's a huge amount of work and tools that are at your disposal to heal from that. And ultimately, my message is one of hope because, you know, where I am today, I'm so privileged to be fully healed. Like, yes, I have an Achilles heel on certain topics and I can get overly angry about, you know, injustices in that area. But generally, my PTSD is gone. It might get triggered here and there if I see like a, a movie that brings me back, but that's pretty rare and the reaction would be pretty low. But I think, and I wish I had known before going through this that how much I could do as a non-survivor to help a survivor. And one of the biggest things to me, which was like heartbreaking was how isolated I felt. Mm. Because the people who did know you know, it's hard, like it's hard to meet somebody's gaze. It's hard to treat them like they're a normal person. It's hard to have the banter with them, but that's what they want. And they needed maybe a little bit more gentleness and compassion. Mm. But I think it starts with conversations.